do some wild fishing chores here. We are going to uh, give you a different video today. Uh, we're going to change out the boat winch. So, this is a different deal. When you use these older winches, and let me show you. Gear. So, if this is 400 pounds, you're pulling 400 pounds. So it's very difficult, unless your boat is floating, to reel this up on the trailer if there's any kind of resistance, okay? Uh, obviously, it's time to change. Everything's ripped, broken. It's time to go. So, got three bolts here. We're gonna take those bolts off. Get this one thrown away. Also, as you can see, I got uh, warping here in the handle, so it's all bad. So the new one that I got, There we go. Two speed, it's a Fulton deal, and what happens is it changes your gear ratio. So, like if you're pedaling a, a 10 speed bike, right? The lower the gear. Well, same with this one. It's very, very easy to crank, but it's bringing the boat forward, and there's no uh, pressure on me, there's no. Um, no resistance to me. It's a two speed, high and low speed. Make it very easy to uh, put the boat on the trailer by myself. So, got my sockets here. Got a couple sockets, a couple end wrenches. Go ahead and get this sucker off the boat real quick. That's it, that's how easy it is. These things come on and off really easy, guys. It's not a big deal. Um, three bolts, couple socket and wrench, and boom, done. How you wanna do this, obviously, when you put this on, Fulton goes towards the vehicle. The open end of this goes towards the boat, because this is where your strap will go into, right? So it comes with the strap, and uh, you simply, take a couple of these things off you take that small bolt see there's two bolts in there take the small one out we'll take this cover off we'll take the small one out this will go through that bolt and you wind up your new winch line you can do what you want um, they have it designed for here your handle on boom just like this so let's go ahead and get this mounted and then we'll get the handle and everything else on three bolts on put this one down three bolts in get a finish tighten on them Winch on. Now we gotta play with the strap. Strapped up, ready to go. I had to change battery, sorry about that. Finish cracking this up. So what's going on right now, the reason I'm cranking it is because inside there that uh, strap is very loose, it's tightening itself. Uh, two speed work. Makes it very easy. So, don't forget guys, I'll show you how this works. Never, ever, ever forget guys. Always put a safety chain on there. Look at that, I don't know if we can see. Today, 
release that tension a little bit, pull this out. Neutral, free spool, no problem. Put it on the other side, that's your reverse, right? Pull it out, free spool, put it over here, crank it up. Boom, Fulton guys, Fulton two speed. Anything above a 10 foot boat, you guys are Amazon so uh, very easy I'll go show you real quick put the three bolts on strap on connected to the boat cranked it up good to go held off and held off and held off but it is worth the money um, I know a lot of people that have one and they love it so if you want to make it super easy read the directions Directions around here somewhere? I don't know. I looked at the picture, I put it together. It's on the boat, it works. Straps facing the boat. Straps not facing the truck. We're doing good. So, uh, this one's just a box. Obviously, it was time for me to get a new one. Single gear. My strap boat broke, the emergency bowling knot. So, what I'll probably do is uh, you know, because I'm that I'm that old guy that likes to keep stuff. So, guys, from this one, I will keep the the hook, and I'll keep the mounting hardware uh, with the boat just in case. I don't know if something weird happens. I always have an extra set of mounting stuff, guys. I, I've done this long enough. Having an extra set of something is always good. This one going to the truck. I just replaced this uh, earlier this spring for boat maintenance for my front roller. You know, everything, make sure everything's tight. Check all these bolts and stuff. Trying to get things put together. Very simple. Replace the winch on the boat. Things that need to be done. Things that, uh, you know, behind the scenes. What do I do behind the scenes? I do a lot of stuff behind the scenes. It's extremely successful on the water uh, when I take you guys out. So, love this stuff. Gonna put my couple tools away. Again, I used a half inch and a 916 socket. Everything went together, one end wrench, and we're good to go. So, put my tools away, go in, get a bite to eat, guys. Uh, remember, check us out on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram, all at deuceswildfishingcharters.com, and check out my website, deuceswildfishing.com. Guys, we'll see you on the water. Tight lines.